Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm your boy Flash Hazardous. And we're knee deep in an assault grenadier run. Which I think we'll just go ahead and kick off right away, shall we? So let me let me go back into the lobby. We do want to take the assault grenadier over here. And carry on the game that we started. So where did we end off last time? We're in the refinery map. We've got a nice build going. Not 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 overpowered, but certainly space for improvement. We we had the rather interesting interaction with the doggos last time. I hope you guys enjoyed part one. And fingers crossed that we get a really good run going over here in part number two. So, shall we start without delay? Oh. Man, these guys are hard to kill. There we go, doggo. That's what you want a doggo for. There we go. Unfortunately, killed by the other doggo. So it looks like unstoppable force beat immovable object over there. <clears throat> right, so back at the Shrine of Zia, I really do like picking up a Twin Zeal of Zia again over here, just for more activation points on our Orb of Lightning. That does feel like something that's really good. Weapon shots can fire lightning bolts. And we just need to keep on pumping this up to see if we can't break it. So, pretty easy pick here. Twin Zeal of Zia. Guys, quick channel update on my part. I am still working on that patch notes video. Can't wait to get it out to you guys. There's a lot of recording to do. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a really, really long video. Um, and I'm just trying to figure out how best to... To slice it up and deliver it to you guys right so back here anyway so i think my plan right now is i'm going to get a couple more episodes out um maybe finish this run maybe do it and maybe stop this run midway and and just focus on the patch notes to get something out for you guys i think you'll really like it lots of i've done a lot of analysis got a lot of word uh, a lot of kind of points i want to discuss with you guys just a matter of finding the right time to do it uh, and it's tough to do this week given I've got a fairly tough work uh, schedule at work. And I'm just looking to to try get content out um, while still working on the patch notes review. So that's the update there. Hopefully sooner rather than later. Definitely this week. Um, we've heard that there isn't going to be any further patch notes or any further patches. Maybe a small one, Shrike said. We kill this riot god. Maybe a smaller patch note, a uh, smaller patch that comes out later this week. But we'll see what happens. I, I really do want to get that out for you guys. So that'll be my focus most definitely after this run. There we go. Really liking the Akita over here. So that's the update, guys. Hope you'll, hope you'll bear with me. Hope you'll be patient with me. And we'll have a really good video out for you guys as soon as I find some time to do some cuts and start the recording. Everything's ready. I just need my cuts of videos and and the actual recording piece to start. So let's see where that gets us in the next couple of days. So we got our doggo out. Go, doggo, go. Go, doggo, go. We ended up killing our own doggo, unfortunately. Press F to pay respects, boys. Okay, so quite nice, guys. Another thing that wasn't in the patch notes, it looks like they've fixed... Looks like they fixed the oil spills in that it just slows you down rather than stopping you. So that's quite a nice change. Very nice. Another thing that wasn't in the patch notes, so maybe I'll have to add it to the video. Oh, yes, please. I haven't seen a PSR 500 in a while. Oh, that is good. I'm really happy with that. Let's see how this performs. So what are we doing over here? Let's do a little bit of a... I don't know why... Why couldn't I attack him? That was really weird. There we go. Do I get behind this guy? Or just smash him in the face? That works as well. I don't know why my commander didn't go off a little bit earlier. Ooh, another one over here. Get around the back of him. One thing to note, guys, from... What in the world? Hello? <laughs> Why, hello there, sir. Uh, sir, are you are you in distress up there? Do we need to fall, call the fire? 
Call the fire department to get you down, sir. Yeah? Oh, poor lost little. <laughs> Maintain location. He's too scared to come down, boys. <laughs> All right, let's go buy high, sell low here, guys. I think that's the right place to go. Yeah, yeah, let's go with that. Buy high, sell low. I like that one. Really liking the Akita, boys. I feel like we're going to get something broken going with this Orb of Lightning. Get a reload over here. There we go. And that sounded like a bit of a casino machine, didn't it? <clears throat> so like we were saying last episode, really enjoying the Assault Grenadier movement speed. After a fairly torrid time with the God Judge. Very slow moving compared to... Get the hell out of here. I don't like fighting looking down bottom to the right. Alright. Get a grenade out here. Okay. Get a good position over here. I don't have any more bullets for that gun. There we go. Doggo's out. Go doggo. Go doggo. Go doggo. Right. Okay. Right. Get in here. Nice. Okay. Really enjoying the movement speed. Really enjoying the freedom the class offers. It really does feel like at any point in time, you can get away from the danger that's presented to you, which is which is quite nice. Not something that you can say for all classes. God Judge particularly just couldn't stand how slow he moves, but I do I do think I can learn to play him a little bit better. Nice. Reload. There we go. Good stuff. Oh, what is this going off? It's all the mines going off. Boy. This is what I wonder. I mean, we're dropping mines wherever we go because we got the fusion mine ability. I just worry that I'm ending up blowing myself up if, if I end up running into that blast radius. It's just one of the reasons why I thought the mines wouldn't be that good an item. Purely because of the fact that it, it, does, it does feel a little bit risky. There we go. That sounds like a bit of a casino, doesn't it? Casino on wheels. Isn't that a novel idea? <clears throat> okay. Try collect ourselves here and play a little bit better. A little bit more conservatively. Let's try get a couple of shots off here. We'll probably just punch him in the face over there. Got another item box. Talking about the lottery boys. Oh, we got a Guardian. So that's another summon ability that we've got here. And with low shields that we've got, we should be able to activate that quite often. Are we going to go with some sort of a summon build here? Hmm. That would be, could definitely be quite interesting. Oh, God damn it. There we go. Right. So we've got a shop. We don't have that much gold. Hopefully we can supplement a bit by going around and killing a few more things. And come back here towards the exit and end up just piling on with some of the goodness of the upgrades. Get a grenade out over here. We get activated. Oh, specialization ability. Okay, okay. That's changed. Uh, seven? Guy? Thank you. There we go. What does this do exactly? What does this turret do? Anyone know what it's meant to be doing? Did he just heal? He healed. I think he healed. Okay. Another item box. I think let's let's keep playing around with Guardian. Interesting. So you you trigger it with your specialization ability, but I didn't even use the specialization ability there, did I? Oh, okay. Anyway, I think we're going to keep uh, messing around with the Dog Whistle and the Guardian. So maybe we should try and get rid of something else. I think we're going to get rid of these Fusion Mines, if I'm being completely honest with you guys. 300, so that's a, a low tier item. Let's see if we can get a higher tier item. Yes, we can. Very happy with the Shock Current. Happy to pick that up for sure. Oh, got some buddy. Oh. Uh, I think the dog's in the way. There we go. Go, dog. 
Go, go, doggo. <laughs> oh, they do get in the way. Gonna need to do something about the collision on this because you can't even get these units to move. You have to kill them if you want to move around sometimes because they get stuck on walls. What kind of a chest is that, by the way? Is that a... Uh, it's a health. It's a healing chest. Again, I'm trying to figure out where I got all my extra health from, guys. Okay, so we got the shield booster, which gives us an extra 250 shields. But what's causing... What's causing us to get the extra health? I can't make... I can't make heads and toes of that, honestly. It's, it's really weird. I don't think I have any items that, that end up supplementing my gold, uh, my, my health. So if anyone else can figure that out, I'm all ears. But right now, I don't understand why I'm at 3,900 gold over there. Oh, 3,900 health. Very strange to me. Okay, nice. Got a whole bunch of guys over here. Get a grenade in there. Nice. Nice. <clears throat> Again, not sure why I'm summoning these guys. Are these both class specializations? Wait a second, guys. Aren't bundle grenades supposed to be class core ability? Not class specialization. Isn't the tactical advance supposed to be class specialization? Oh. Odd, that one. Okay. Should keep that in mind, because that, that just feels wrong. That doesn't feel right at all. Right. Nice. Let's use our, our sprint ability a bit more liberally. We can. We can afford to. I think this is uh, back to the start of the level. Right. Guys, so this is the start of the level. We've done a full circle round. I'm going to save us the time by cutting us back to the weapon shop at the exit. So give me one second. And we're back, boys. We're back at the exit by the shop. And let's see what we're going to spend our money on. So, just a couple of thoughts here, guys. I'm thinking, why don't we try pivot into a summon build? We've got, we've got the dog whistle. Okay. We've got the guardian. If we can get the guardian down to a low enough level, we can just keep... We can just keep... Uh, spamming these guys it's odd that it gives you a double trigger right so it triggers with your specialization ability and then it says losing shield summons a guardian is that something that's broken hmm i see no reason why we don't start trying to break the guardian so what do we got here we've got 550 we should have enough for three three upgrades I mean, we could continue with the Orb of Lightning, but let's try break something. Let's do something different. Let's try do a summon build, right? Let's just try it. Why not? Okay, increased effect duration affects anything with duration. I don't think this thing has duration. It would be nice to get the cooldowns reduced by 25%, which would be great. I think we do write that, actually. Off the bat. Let's get that down. What's 25% of 60? 12. 15? Should be good. Well, oh, wait, wait, wait a second. Wait a second, guys. What's 25% of... Is that 20%? Quick charge 20%? I don't know. Okay, anyway. <clears throat> Multicasting is interesting. Effect power will scale up the summon. Max charges is not a bad one. Because then we can just activate twice. But it does increase our cooldown by 20%. 25% of double cast is nice. Double cast or multi cast? Go double cast first. Go again. 3D stacking, effect power 25%. Maybe we should maybe we should start doing that. Minimum stacks by 30%. That should give us another stack, right? How does the power randomization work? Surely we can get a decent one off that. Maximum charges by two recharges, one more charge each cycle. That's not bad. Slows down shield delay by 100% though, while on cooldown. That's a long cooldown as well. Let's try the power randomization. It's a 50% that we got on top of that, okay? And then we run out of money. Man, it's a bit disappointing we couldn't break it some more, but let, let's see how this works now. Let's try to get extra charges on it next time. 
We got the exit. Let's move on. <clears throat> Making good time. First level down in just around 15 minutes. Okay. Okay, so we already have enemies attacking us here. Let's get a grenade out. Nice. Oh, damn. Okay, good stuff. I think we can keep on um, buffing on Nanata. So, it does look like this is another level where they've changed the spawns. It doesn't feel nearly as threatening as it used to. It's a lot more spread out. At least that's how it feels. We had a we had a stack. We had one over here. I would have stacked down in here. And pretty much everything else seemed okay. Maybe we had one more here, but it, it didn't come out and attack us too quickly, so... I don't know whether to say it's been fixed, like the really difficult spawns on the start of a level have been fixed, because we have had examples of it not being fixed, like uh, our last run with the... with the guard judge when we went to one of the... Uh, in the purple levels. But, um... But yeah... Hopefully, hopefully that's something we can find out more of as we go and progress. We'll see which starting area is a lot more difficult than others. So let's see. Hyperfeed, class, spec. We're not using that one too much, unfortunately. Uh... No ammo cost is okay. I don't know how, 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 how hot I feel about hyperfeed. He thinks another one, unless we get a high heat weapon, where it actually is helping us out a ton. Let's get rid of heatsink. Doesn't feel like we're going to get a... <clears throat> a warthog. Or something along those lines. Let's see what we're picking up here. Mortar barrage. Class specialization calls in a series of mortar strikes. Okay. Again, class specialization. Again, this I think has to be a bug when there's double class specializations. That, R that right mouse button click should be the core ability, I think. But now we've got double triggers. Uh, so we've got another trigger on class specialization. And we got the dog now. Very nice. Let's follow these guys. Man, the dog is murdering. What is this guy shooting at? Okay, let's get an upgrade for our weapon. Last one. I think we just get more bullets in the magazine. Happy with that. 26 bullets. That's not too shabby. Okay, another one down. Get the hell out of here. Whoa, it just goes past my god there. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, boys. Nice. Okay. By the way, guys, I'm going to have to really quickly pause and exit the game here. I'm going to do that. Let's just first see what the guard judge is killing. It's going to kill a Jeffrey over here. There we go. Okay. I'm going to quickly cut, guys, and rebind my keys. And we're back, boys. Sorry about that. <clears throat> keys have been rebound. I haven't been using either of these two abilities every time I click and only realize that it's because the keys... The key rebindings that I had set have been reset. So let's let's get one of these out. Oh my god, I ended up killing my own guys. Explosive ended up killing my own guys. There we go. Okay. So let's keep moving up through this level. <clears throat> uh got our one of the teleporter pads this way. I don't think we have anything along this way. One thing that's a little bit annoying with summons in this game is they don't follow you around. They just tend to stand still. Like, he's not going anywhere, is he? So they, they basically just end up being useful for the one fight, don't they? And then they're gone. Because he's not following me. He is not following me. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here. 
Right. Some damage there. Get a grenade out here. That was pretty good. Doggo is doing magic over there. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> oh no, it shot that guy in the back. Oh, the sniper. There we go. Well, oh, it looks like the summon was useful in the end. <clears throat> Okay, so navigated that one quite successfully. He's taking out a tower over there. Oh, that's why. Okay. They end up getting shot in the back by that guy. So we, it was funny. We had a multi-cost or a double cost for the Guardian. And then because we threw a grenade when we did that, it ended up exploding in the back of the guy. Quite funny, actually. Another one out. Eject here, Let's work our way back round, smash it in the face. Okay. Got another item shop over here. Maybe another orb of lightning? Do we go for that? I think so. Why not? Sidewinder. Triggers on weapon shots, fires homing missiles, these explosive. Oh, why have I not seen a sidewinder before? Why do I feel like that's the first time I've seen a sidewinder? That orb of lightning is really expensive though. See if it's gonna be worthwhile picking up. Let's check what we're dropping again. <clears throat> Got a nice shock build going so far, along with like a part summon build. I think we can get rid of the hyper feed over here. So 450, meaning that hyper feed was, I guess, one level above on the rarity than the 300 recyclable tier items. The ones that recycle for 300 gold. What are we getting here? Fusion mines. Uh, question now is do we end up getting a sidewinder? I mean, I think it's worthwhile, right? We can end up... We end up dropping the fusion mines for 300. Gives us more gold, and we can actually go and pick up a Sidewinder. Let's go Sidewinder, why not? I feel like I haven't used the Sidewinder before. It does trigger on shots. We've got a high, high fire rate burst fire weapon. That is fully attached up. And the dogs are. Man, this is brutal. Why is this guy shooting here? <laughs> What's he shooting at? <laughs> yeah, so they're going to be stuck up there. We should remember that they're there in case we have to fall back at any point in time in our run. Okay. <clears throat> Right, so far, it looks like we did miss a box down there, so we might have to go back and check that one out. Ooh, what was that? Is that an enemy on top? I think it is. Yeah, it's a tower on top. Okay, 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 let's, let's go. Very nice with the explosive over there. Get the hell out of here. Got our two guards over here, so we can uh, get some enemies to come this way. Maybe not. Okay. We still just look at the doggo, admire him from a distance, not shoot him down. Okay, let's keep moving. Uh. Oh shit. Okay. Oops. There we go. Got another doggo out. That's very nice. We should try get the dog, um, the canine. The K9 whistle <clears throat> upgraded as well. Be interesting to see what it actually, what power actually relates to. Is it just the summon? It might just be the summon. The strength of the summon might relate to the power level. So there might be no way of getting the the uh, the charges reduced from ten every ten enemies killed down to lower. That would be quite nice. Okay. Very nice. Have I seen a lot of these? 
Yeah, it looks like the side one it did come out actually. So get this reloaded. Very nice. Okay. Summons are doing work. Definitely. Get this reloaded. We've got our grenades back. Can just throw that that way. Very good. Okay. Move in over here. Very nice. Good stuff. <laughs> okay. So, what do we know? We know we need to use a teleporter pad to get back up to... We know we need to use that teleporter pad. Another doggo. That's really good. Okay. So, teleporter pad to get up to the top for sure. I am going to cut really quickly here, guys. And I'm going to go run into... Um, I'm going to go run back and see what we missed in terms of this pickup over here. And I'll be right back next to the teleporter. And we are back, boys. So we're just about to take the teleporter up. We got really bad memories about this teleporter, guys. <laughs> uh, so we are going to be very vigilant as we go up here. There we go. We got rid of one. Yeah, we're taking lots of damage here. Get the fuck out of here. Holy moly. <laughs> okay, no idea how we survived that. Absolutely zero idea how we survived that. What a clusterfuck, guys. Absolute clusterfuck. Let's try and make some distance here between us and the enemy. Okay, so... Okay. Sorry guys, keeping it really quiet here so that I can actually not die. And we got fucking canisters everywhere. Okay, just get some weaponry out here. We'll do the job. Man, this guy is tanking the hell out of me. Okay. Serves me right for trying to take him out front on. Ooh. Man, this area is just terrifying terrifying guys i mean look at this as well there's like there's those things there too sheesh that is that is no joke okay <clears throat> let's keep trying to break our guardian over here do we do another double another double cost do we get the charges up what do we actually have on it right now? Power randomization, dual channel, and quick charge. Huh. Let's try doing a multicasting. Let's try that one. Then maybe let's go with the sidewinder over here. Hmm. Don't know if I want to keep it upgraded though. Odd, what is the side one in terms of level? Well, it looks like it's a. Uh... Looks like it's an it's not an epic. Okay, so it's a rare or an uncommon, a rare. I don't know how you call that in this game. Spread it out a bit more. Let's do something with the with getting the dog out. 30% chance for critical activation. Get the effect power higher. Get get a stronger dog. And then let's do one more. One more upgrade. Uh, let's go back to our shock lightning. What do we have so far? Multicasting, item overdrive, and extension. Hmm. Let's try a quad cast. Alright. That feels like it's probably quite good. Now we just need some healing. Because we... 
are 100% down on health over here. We need to play really carefully here. Oh god, I don't like I don't like moving down into the Look at this guys. This is literally asking to be killed. Look at this. I don't want to walk in there and just get my head blown off cuz it'll, it'll be a it'll be one explosion that takes me out of this. You can see it already. Okay, let's see. Are we fine here? Okay. Get this one out. Uh, got multiple enemies here. Nice. Okay. Just want to shoot these down, guys, so we don't end up getting in trouble here. Okay, there's our healing kit that we desperately need. Run and get that. Okay, a bit more breathing room. We've got a weapon crate down here. Okay, let's let's get another one of these out. Heard a dog. Yeah, we've got a dog coming. And we've got our own dog now, which should be quite strong. Should be quite strong. We didn't get a we didn't get what do we end up putting on the on the dog whistle? Just an item overdrive. Okay, so it's a, it's gonna be stronger. By a factor of 1.5% or 50% stronger. Okay, so weapon crate. <clears throat> Let's see what we get here. Iron ESC 900. Uh I think this is a really good SMG. My only issue is that we got double SMG already. I'd like some long distance as well. Increase accuracy when continually fired. What's it got? Cadency. Cadence. Passive increases fire rate. Improves base power of class abilities. That's pretty good. It does look like it's on a cooldown, so it doesn't. It's not. It's not a permanent increase. I think we're going to keep the uh, keep the distance weapon here, and we've already fully upgraded the the Akita, So let's just let's just stick with that. Okay, over here we're going to have some enemies for sure. Are we? Yep, we are. Nice. Dog's doing a smashing job over there. <clears throat> okay. Please, no Russian roulette. <laughs> okay. <laughs> not only was it the only thing, guys, it, it was... Not only was it the only... Was it actually offered to us, it was the only option that we could afford. What did you expect of me? Did you expect anything different? Did you expect anything different, guys? Seriously? Knowing... Knowing how bad my gambling addiction is there? You expect anything different? Hey, the dog is here. Man, that dog is doing work. Okay. Get behind him or just punch him in the face. Okay. So, we're almost at the carrying capacity. We should use our weapon upgrades now. Let's start with the with the PSR 500. Lightweight receiver. I wouldn't mind that. When health is full, crit damage. I'm a big fan of movement speed. I really like it. I like this one as well with health being full. But we're going to get plinked quite often with such a low uh, shield pool. So, I think we're just going to go with a lightweight receiver. And then let's do one more upgrade. Underbarrel link, movement accuracy, projectile firing items, increases critical hit chance. So this can't be a projectile firing item, right? Laser grip, increases movement accuracy, increases critical chance, and then on hitting enemies, decreases recoil, incre decreases fire rate. That's weird. Okay. We're going to go with this one. Some movement accuracy. Massive movement accuracy. And critical hit chance. That, that feels really good. <clears throat> Alright. So let's move to the next area. Let's try to see if we can't get some, some uh, riot guards out right off the bat over here to defend us against whatever the starting area is going to be here. Okay, right. So we got enemies down, we got enemies up. Let's get this out. 
Oh no. <laughs> Boys. Boys. Guys, where are we going? Okay, guys. Everyone in, in line. Uniform movement. Let's go. We want to be a team here. Want to be a team here. Want to move towards our goal uniformly. Okay, I'm getting the hell out of here, boys. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Oh, doggo, you got in the way. Very nice. Man, that was funny. It was such a pity that they got absolutely destroyed by that mortar. I think it was a mortar somewhere around here. Took out all of the... <laughs> all four riot guards, guys. We had multicasting go off there. <laughs> we had a multicast go off on a duel. Was that like a double dual channel or something funny? That was weird. There we go. Shouldn't be reloading with that many bullets, really. Hey. Okay. Get another nade out here. Very good. <clears throat> right. Get fully reloaded up here. And let's see how we go. Did we end up getting the... Guys, I feel... Yeah, we did. Yeah. So it looks like we still have the bug, guys. For sure. For sure, the bugs here. So we... On the Akita, we got the short magazine spring. And for some reason, we have three extra bullets in our DMR as well as, I'm sure, our pistol. Yeah. So it looks like the... It looks like the short magazine spring applies to all your weapons and not just one. I mean, not complaining, but... <laughs> Probably not something that should be in the game. Right, so what do we have down this way? Okay. There we go. That's good. Okay, got some money. And we have nothing over there. Let's keep moving. Come on, boys. Oh, what the hell? Did my commander... What happened there? Guys? <laughs> did I just like commando my own guy in the back? I think I did. Alright, that's good. Okay, so he's shooting at something. I don't ex exactly know what he's shooting at. Yeah, we've got a dog. Oh, okay. Doggo, you wanna help me out here? Go, dog, go, go. Man, look at that machine go. Look at him go, the boys. Oh, crap. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Get our shields back up and we can re-engage. There we go. <clears throat> Get some credits over here. What in the world is going on down there? Someone's shooting at us, I think. Okay, so we got a... Got a compositor here. Right. Are you taking the damage there, unfortunately? Come on. Come on. Okay. Health back to full, and let's see what we can get from the compositor, guys. <clears throat> what are we going for here? We're not making much use of our tactical advance and our field supply, to be honest. The days of running into groups of enemies are far behind us, unfortunately. Let's see what we can do and get out of our bundle grenade. No? Do we want to do that? Let's go frictionless boots again. Maybe see if we can't get some invulnerability. The battery... Increases damage to stun by 50% last 3 seconds. Would be a nice combination with our shock current, but we're not really building into that at the moment. This is crit chance for a very short period of time, and this is composite accuracy. Activates a class ability, reduces recoil by 100%, lasts for 1.5 seconds. Okay, well let's go with that. 
Okay. Oh, we got three. Man, these summons have been doing a good job for us. And the Akich has been really, really uh, surprisingly solid, actually. Very nice. Good stuff. Activating on uh, the Orb of Lightning quite often here. Okay, so there is... There is... Yeah, there's a, a new tower over here. Just run into it and smash it down. Ah, didn't hit it. Did not hit? Did not hit? Mind. Doesn't look like it's weird. I couldn't get the commando ability to go off there. How does this thing re? This thing really needs a better indicator for when it's when it's activatable. It needs to be another color. It needs to be clearer to see when this thing is activatable, because the gray color doesn't do a lot of uh, help with knowing when it's off cooldown. Okay, so we got another I another item box over here. I think at this point we probably wanna. I'm going to go and get rid of the Helsing Power. Helsing Power Bolt. Let's see what we get from the box. Hit list. Nice. Okay. I'll keep hit list. That's a very strong one. Okay. We've, we're forgetting to do all of the good abilities that we should be doing. We should be flipping weaponry quite often to get elite movement. We're literally... We're playing it really lax from a class perspective over here. Oh, now he's going to get in the way. Now we can't get through. That's annoying. Are we missing any crates? I think we are. There we go. Did we not pick up the ammo there? Yeah, we did. Okay. Let's see what we're missing from a crate perspective. I think there is a crate that we missed over here. Oh, it's only down. Okay. Nice. So that's another thing they've changed. And this is new. So many of these things are new, guys. Look at this. So, now the map indicates when something's on a different plane. So, you can see that we found a box there, but because the box is on a different plane, one level beneath us, it shows it now. That's really cool. That definitely wasn't the case before. I'm, I'm almost 100% certain of that. There we go. Okay. And, uh... There we go. Three of our three of these guys. Look at them. Look at these champions. Chads. Come on, Chads. Man, they just get wrecked by this thing, don't they? Okay. Interesting. We need to get their power level a bit higher for the Guardians, because they they seem to be getting outstripped in terms of power right now. For some of these enemies. There we go. Man, this Akita's been doing work for us. Really strong. Just because we keep getting the Orb of Lightning to trigger off of it. I can barely see the Sidewinder missiles go out. But I'm definitely seeing the Orb of Lightning just absolutely go ham. And this one doesn't look like it's got... Does this even have a cooldown? No, it doesn't. It just... It just triggers, right? Just, it just triggers. So it's not like it's not like the rockets like the mavericks or the sidewinders it just triggers all the time whenever there's an enemy near i mean whenever you actually trigger it of course but there's no there's no cooldown before it triggers which is great well actually let's just see if there is we might be talking rubbish here let's see okay well didn't seem to need a trigger there right <laughs> always dangerous changing levels or changing planes so let's let's see where this takes us give me one second guys i'll be back and we're back let's change levels here i just went back to see if i had missed a crate or anything crate or three get weapons reloaded
Wow. Okay, so we got another multicast over here. I think. Oh, jeez. You want to come this way, guy? I've got a surprise for you. There we go. Come on, boys. Go. Get him! Get him! Get him, boys. Come on. Keep moving. Keep moving, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What the hell is this? Oh. Very good. Right. <clears throat> Okay. Okay, good. Still no health loss. We're happy with that. Got another item we can pick up over here. Struggling to see what we're going to pick up, to be perfectly honest with you guys. I feel like the mortar is still something that doesn't work. We need, we need to test this out properly. I might be completely blind. Let's remember that we've got something here. We'll come back for it. Power printing, we don't need. First fire delay is pretty good. It's currently held weapon. Let's go with that. We got the Akita equipped. Yeah, we do. Get that onto this gun. That is pretty fucking insane. Okay, let's see. We'll come back and get the item. Okay, good stuff. Doggo is making... Okay, we gotta get out of here. Oh, okay, gotta be careful now. See if we get attacked here. Okay, we gotta be careful with that guy. Good stuff. Okay, got double. That's good. Try to see if we can't get our our squad moving up northeast here. Good stuff. Let's keep going, boys. Remember, work as a team. Man, they, they do have a funny thing where they shoot at the next target all the time. Oh, gosh. This weapon is getting nasty at the moment. Really strong. Okay. I think we've cleared it out. I think we've cleared it out. That's it. I think it's just the boss left and this is any enemies down on this platform. Let's see what we get for a weapon over here. Nemesis. <clears> hmm. <throat> I don't know, guys. I feel like the Nemesis... Um... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Not a bad engaging weapon, right? Pick it up. Take a shot. And then flip over to the Akita. You know, let's just let's just stick with that. I mean, what do we still have on the PSR? We've got two upgrades. Let's just stick with the PSR, guys. We haven't played with this one all that much. Not not for a while, at least. Let's just get another upgrade here. Full hit chance by 10% and heat by 10%. That should be good. I'm happy with that. Okay. Right. So, we have... An item shop. Do we want anything here? Should we get another dog whistle? That'd be an interesting one to get, isn't it? I think so. Dog whistle might be fun to go for, actually. We haven't tested out the damn mortar barrage again. Odd. I don't know. I'm going to drop the mortar barrage just because I don't think it's working. And get another dog whistle. Why not? We're just dicking around at this point anyway, right? We can get a lot of cash out of this. And then we pick up the dog whistle. Why not? Let's go full summons, guys. Very nice. So we got the boss. Let's reload everything and just give us a couple of seconds for the Guardian to fully recharge. And then we can just summon the moment we get into the map. <clears throat> And let's go. Refinery boss, here we come. Okay, we just got to be careful here.
Okay, so far so good. Let's get a grenade out. Oh no, this is not going to go well for these guys. <laughs> okay, doggo is out. Can the doggo attack? Yes, he can. Doggo was attacking there, guys. Okay. Try and get another... Oh, we're taking some health damage here. Okay. Keep doing this. Okay. Good stuff. Is he going to target my summon me? Okay, we run out of bullets. So let's pick up some more ammo over here. So far, so good, guys. Not really much of a threat with the high mobility that we've got. We're keeping a good distance here. Good that he ends up attracting attention from the summons as well, which is really good. Okay, do one more round. We can, no we can't, it's fine. Uh, that's not good. Okay. Okay, keep going. And we're good, I think. There we go. Good stuff. Very good stuff. Very happy with that, guys. Synthetic 2, you are truly the gift that keeps on giving. Just giving. I mean, we're heading into Christmas, guys, and this is just priceless. Honestly, this is priceless, guys. I love the way the dog just keeps on attacking there. Uh, can't even shoot it. That's fine. Get the hell out of here. Let's pick up our item. Oh, that dog's determined, guys. Kernel of burning cores while overheating any abilities perks or items gain a chance to critically to critically strike on activation with double their power while overheating. Okay, I wonder if that means you have to be overheated, or it can be just any level of overheating, or whether it scales with overheating. That'd be quite interesting. All right, so good opportunity to jump into the next level now and get rid of this really annoying dog noise that we got going here. Can you shoot these things? Okay, come on. Okay, let's get going. And I think we're just going to see where we've landed. We're going to clear out the starting area. Oh, obviously it's the Barge of Doom. Okay, we've got to do this, guys. So we're going to... Is that my guy? No, it's not. Okay. Get a couple of our guys out here. There we go. And we've got a dog out. That's good. That's good. Let's, let's use them to advance. Uh, damn it, man. Honestly, the collision is killing me here. Okay, so he's still good. Keep moving, keep moving. Try to get the attention here. Good, good. Looks like we can handle those guys. Okay. Get ourselves just. Okay, we're still okay, we're still okay. Right, we're still okay, still alive. Let's get ourselves some more summons. Man, these summons are getting in my way, guys. Why is it such a shit show at the start, guys? <laughs> Wow, that's been a, a nice introduction to the icy level. At least we seem to have done enough to get off of the barge of broken dreams here. Yeah? Right. Fully reloaded. Let's go. Let's go. 
Oh, okay. Dog goes back up. That's good. Let's try to clear out a little bit more over here. Good, good job, doggo. Man, double doggo. Let's go. Why do I feel like I've lost my weapon attachments here? Like, oh, we've really run out of bullets here. Man, that's not good for the Akita. So, <clears throat> what is it that's meant to be giving us the increased... The increased burst in our gun. We've got burst optimization. It doesn't feel like that burst fire delay is applying anymore, though. Weird. What the hell's going on there? I don't know what those dogs were doing. They got confused there for a second. Yeah, let's get reloaded. Let's clear out the bottom area here, and then I think we can call it an episode, guys. Right, I don't know what activated there. Yeah, that's good. <clears throat> right, so anything down here? Item box? a nice way to end an episode let's pick up the item box guys what are we going for here so uh what do we get rid of you know what i just say we go and get rid of the i say we just keep going into the summons build and we get rid of the um the sidewinders here yeah that's fine i know we bought it at least we get some recouped value, so we haven't spent too much. Net net differential on spend is 150. Another orb of lightning. I can live with that. Okay. Guys, thank you so much for joining me in part two. We have successfully navigated our way to the frozen tundra, the icy hellhole. And we've gotten off the barge of broken dreams. Here's to hoping that we have another successful run with a grenadier class. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy the content, please leave a like. Please leave a subscribe. If you don't, leave a dislike. Let me know what I can do better. Um, please do leave comments, guys. Let me know. Uh, can I play better? What can I do? New classes to play, new things to play. I love engaging with you guys. So please do leave comments. And I'll catch you in the comments area. Until then, I'm Flash Hazardous, signing out.